Yes, the tables of stone were found in the Ark of the Covenant. I personally, personally removed them with the assistance of four angels who lifted the mercy seat, which I would estimate weighs about 900 pounds of solid gold. And one of these angels told me to take the tables of stone out of there. He said, God wants everyone to see those. And so I took them out, backed up, stood there, frozen in place, and I, I, well, I just can't describe my physical state or mental state or anything else. If, if, you know, I didn't have some physical evidence to prove it happened, I think I had a dream or something. But anyway, they are now available to be shown, but we won't say, uh, actually they're on a stone ledge right in the same chamber, that's where the angel put them after I handed them to him, I didn't know what to do with them. And uh, I was told that these are to be presented with the blood evidence when the mark of the beast law is passed are enforced. Now, I know everybody wonders about what it is, the mark of the beast. You've heard all kinds of rumors, stories, and all of this. I'll tell you quick and simple. If you keep the Ten Commandments that God wrote upon those tables of stone, and about which he says in Psalms 89 34, those of you that are writing down text, you'll want this one. Psalms 89 34. He says, My covenant will I not break, nor alter the thing that has gone out of my lips. He spoke the Ten Commandments from the mountaintop. He rolled them in stone, and he says, Nothing will change. Right? If you keep that law, you will receive the seal of God. Soon there will be a set of man-made laws best intentions surrounded by a barrage of salubrious soliloquies and sepulchral solicitudes. That's all kinds of stories and all of this instigated by the devil to make you think that this is the best thing that ever happened to the human race and that you could just want to go along with it voluntarily. <clears throat> These man-made laws will require that you break God's Ten Commandments. Christ said of the Pharisees, For it is in vain that they do worship me, teaching for doctrines the commandments of men. If you keep those man-made laws and break God's Ten Commandments, you will receive the mark of the beast. Nobody has the mark of the beast at this point in time. You can only get it after that those laws are enforced.